Hey everyone, today I have a nude makeup look for you. It's a look I've been wearing quite a lot recently just because it's quite subtle yet a little bit glam. So I start off by moisturising my face with Simple Hydrating Lotion and I also moisturise my lips with Shea Butter. Yes, it works really well for the lips as well. I then do my eyebrows using a brow pencil. I use this brow pencil here and you've seen me do my brows um, many times before if you've watched my previous videos I just conceal my brows by putting a little bit on the tip of my elf concealer brush before it used to take me absolutely ages I think it starts with just having a good pencil to start off with and that makes it a little bit easier so that's my brows done in case any of you are wondering why did you shave them off in the first place they weren't shaven off um, I just don't have a lot of hair there and so when I trim them it looks basically like it's completely gone. I'm now going to put on my concealer. Then I take um, a highlighter for underneath my brow. I'm going to take this colour from the Sleek uh, Contour Kit in dark and just dab it and then apply it under the brow. The blush that I'm going to use is a blush that I've grown to love a lot ever since I got it or ever yeah no actually I've had it for ages I just didn't start using it till later on uh, this blush is called coral it's by sleek it's actually in the old packaging because they've updated their packaging now so it looks like this and you can see that I've already hit pan as they say I'm going to use my elf blush brush grab some place it on my cheeks you just apply it to the cheeks like that and before I used to apply blush everywhere, like forehead, chin, everywhere. But um, now I'm kind of like sticking to the to the rules and just applying it to my cheeks. So you can see the blush there. You can see the blush, how it, how it looks on my cheeks. And then the final and probably the most important uh, element of this look, the lips. I'm going to be using the lip liner Cork by MAC, which is a lip liner that I absolutely love. It's a great... Um, lip liner for nude lipsticks um, so I'm just going to apply that you can barely see it being applied literally blends in so well and last but not least my lipstick it was actually recommended to me by a subscriber in my lipstick collection video I asked you guys if you knew any uh, nude lipsticks you know affordable nude lipsticks that would be great for me to try out and I just literally once this was recommended Milani I just literally jumped on eBay and ordered it straight away it was about five it was about six or seven pounds amazing price for what you get it's Milani lipstick um, and I thank you so much or I think it was organic beauty who recommended this lipstick to me um, thank you so much because I love it love because I absolutely love it um, just as much as I love Revlon but to be honest I've been wearing this much more than Revlon I, I've probably worn Revlon once since I got this and it's been like nearly two months I've had this now um, and it smells really good as well it looks like this up close Alani teddy bear and I'll just apply that so that's it and so that's a lipstick apply like it's one of those looks that you can wear during the day and in the evening and that's it for my nude look I really do hope you've enjoyed it I hope it's been useful for you if you do like nude lipsticks I say invest in this Milani teddy bear affordable lipstick thank you so much for being faithful and supporting me for all this time if there's anyone new watching please do hit that subscribe button I'd love to have you around and I'd love to have your suggestions I will see you soon and I hope you have a very happy new year I'll see you in my next video